Hi everybody. So I'm in. I'm in my little nook studio. It's, let's see, what time is it? 10, 14 at night and I'm finally finished. <clears throat> you wouldn't believe what I did today. I can get so much done when I don't have to work and there's nobody around me and I can just function. Sunday was a bummer because I literally was up here for an hour and 12 minutes. You know, when I'm, when I make a mistake, I repeat what I was going to say and then I have to edit that out. And then when I edit, I'm like, this video's too long. I got to cut out this. I got to cut out that. And it's just this long process. And so, you know, figure that you spend an hour well, you spend more than an hour because you're you're preparing yourself, you're you're picking out what you're going to use, then, you know, how you're going to say things. Of course, a lot of times I just sit down and I wing it. I don't have a plan. It's in my head and it comes out of my head. But um this is lucky. This is my little Yorkie. Lucky right there. Who's there right there? You going to say hi? Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. I am a sweet boy. Mm -hmm. Mama loves me. Mama loves me so much. Mama is the lucky one. So, anyway. I will show you pictures of this. Probably within the next couple days. Tomorrow I have to go pick up my new glasses. I mean, they were not able to use the Lens Smart frames that I got for free. So I'm going to be giving them away right here on YouTube. I have, I've given two pairs away and I have three pairs left. And I gave two pairs to my customers for Mother's Day. And I have three pairs left and I'm going to show the pairs and I'm going to, on my community page and I'm going to let people if they're interested I'm going to let them you know they'll have to answer a question and I'll do the same thing I'll spin the wheel and I'll take down three names because there, there's no point in me having these glass frames in my house I'm not going to use them so I'm going to give them away to somebody that can. What happened was is the technician at the optometrist wears this, holds up this special machine. Like she looks into it and she looks directly at my eyes with it. And it shows when you put your glasses on exactly where the lenses are going to go. Well, the frames that I had were too big for my face. So the lenses weren't going to match up with my eyes if they put them in. So um, somebody said, oh, they just want to sell glasses. And the girl that, that I was talking to, she goes, if those frames fit, we would use them. We have people that bring frames in here all the time. And they want a prescription filled. But... These aren't going to work for your face. You have a really small face. So, anyhow, I had to fork out some money from my glasses. And, you know, it's always make, makes me nervous because it's a ton of money. And I thought, well, I'm just going to give back. I'm going to give those frames away. And so look for that in the next couple of weeks because I will be doing a giveaway on those glass frames. And if you're interested and you like them. Um, the, the thing is, is you may like one pair better than the other, but what the heck, they're free. Maybe you could give them away. So um, you can't see the moon. The moon is over there, but that's okay. I've got the mountains behind me, and I don't need anything else. I don't need this fancy-dancy backdrop. It makes me happy mm. to come in here. Um, but yeah, it's this cozy little nook, and then I have a curtain right there. 
that I can draw and have privacy. And I want, let me put Lucky down here. Say, say bye-bye, Lucky. He's got his little Memorial Day scarf on. Say bye-bye, Lucky. <laughs> there you go, boo-boo. Go ahead. So I still have my old ring light, and I've got another light right here. But I have to set up my new light, and I've had it for a couple of weeks. It's just that I wanted to get everything in here. And this... This really is too small, although I could put another table here. I've got some shelving behind the curtain here. And I moved all of our tax boxes. 13 years of them. Not getting rid of them yet. Because um, you never know. And they are heavy, heavy boxes. And I moved, and I made it look nice because... I wasn't going to put them in the basement. They were stored in here, in this little nook, among some other things that I've sifted out. But, so yeah, um, this is the, the ring light that I picked up. This is a multicolor ring light, and it's made by Bauer, Smart Photography Series. And it stands all you can stand it on the floor, or you can stand it on the table, but it's really big, so it will go all the way, it will illuminate all the way around my face. Unlike this little thing that I bought and paid like ten bucks for when I first started out, because I didn't know what I was doing. And this you can also um, create modular variations with it if you want. Like if I want to get another one and I want it to look like this on either side, I could do that. But this is what I'm shooting for and it has a remote control too. It has a, a wireless remote control and it has in the center right here, it has an arm that comes through where you can set up your phone. So that's what I'll be using to do my videos is my phone. I'm going to upgrade my phone next. That's the next thing I'm going to do. Excuse me. But if you look at this picture right here, when you put on the colors, that's what it will make you look like. So I thought that would be fun to do some things like that. Anyway, let me put that aside. I hope you like my mountains. I wish I had some, you know, twinkly lights, but I might. I might. I, I purchased some lights, teeny tiny little lights on a copper wire from Timu. And if I, if they come in, then I can run them all along the mountains because I think there's something, it's something like five yards and they weren't expensive and I never got them. I'm still waiting for them. If, if something is on back, if something is, takes a long time to ship, they will hold it when it comes in, and they will ship it in your next order. So um, I'm hoping that they come in within the next couple of weeks. But that's all I wanted to say tonight, friends. I don't have any makeup on. All I have is Joseph's uh, C4 Serum and Mascara. And I've got a little bit of, I put some highlighter on for eyeshadow. I don't, but I don't have any face makeup on. I don't have any eyeshadow on. I don't have any eyebrow, <laughs> I don't, no lipstick. This is me. 100% me. And it just feels so good to be in a good mood. Tomorrow's going to be a busy day. I'm not going to be home till late. And I'm trying to, I don't know if I will have a chance to do a video on Wednesday either. See, this is what I'm nervous about. Say some prayers for me. Because when my work picks up in the summertime, then I panic. Because, you know, I could do two, sometimes three jobs a day. And I'm dead as a doornail when I come home. I just want to go... So... Say some prayers for me. I mean, for my channel. I would really appreciate it. 
I think that's it. I think that's all I wanted to tell you guys. Oh, one, a couple things. Um, a few people commented on my ring right here. And let me just tell you a quick story. Okay, so this set right here is my mother's 25th wedding anniversary set that I was gifted after she passed away. And then this is a blue diamond. Can you see it? That was given to me by my husband in the year 2000 because my original diamond, which was uh, had a, um, a safety wrap, diamond safety wrap around it, got destroyed basically when my daughter and I were moving furniture it popped out of the setting we had to go searching for the diamond it it broke off prongs I mean luckily the thing saved my finger from breaking my finger but it was there was a little crack in it to begin with because it wasn't it wasn't a flawless diamond I mean we didn't have any money <laughs> it wasn't a flawless diamond but um the 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 force of it getting pushed out gaped it even more and the jeweler said it would cost more than the diamond was worth to fix it. So I just went around with my wedding ring on and I didn't get, um, see we got married in 1995 and I didn't get this until 2000. And I'm trying to remember when, when the diamond debacle happened and then um, my 25th wedding anniversary, my husband bought me this anniversary band right here. And the two carat that I wear is moissanite. It is not a real two carat diamond. It is moissanite. Because I, ref I told him there's no way you're going to pay that kind of money till you die on a twenty thirty thousand dollar ring that's just ridiculous so my 25th wedding set that I t that I typically wear is not that's what it is and I'm thrilled about it there's a lifetime warranty on it because uh, of the diamond industry you know I just have my opinions about it and then I wear my wedding. so this ring um, we will be married 28 years in June, and this was a 35th anniversary ring on a jewelry site. This woman was on, you know, selling, uh, like synthetic diamonds jewelry for 35 years, and so she designed her own ring. And I fell in love with this ring. And it's this, these are all synthetic diamonds. They're not, you know, it didn't cost me a lot of money. I mean, it is not solid gold. It is where they seal the gold to the silver. I've been wearing it and it is not scratched or scraped or anything. I've been wearing this to work because I figured it, it wasn't expensive. But I just love the bling. So, and it's kind of dirty. But, you know, you can, when it's clean, it really sparkles. Um, but, so yeah, I'm, I like to switch things up. And right now, I'm just, I'm loving this ring. I love, it looks antique. I love it. And these I always wear. So, but this is a real blue diamond that my husband bought me. And it has diamond baguettes. And that's that's a really cool story. I'll tell it sometime. Yeah, he he made payments on this. That's why I wouldn't let him make payments on my twenty fifth, which is solid gold and moissanite. So anyway, you guys take care. Be well. Be blessed. Be beautiful because you are. Because there is nobody else on the planet like you. And we will pick up where I left off the other day, hopefully, with my new ring light. 
And I'm excited about that because if I have to do a video at night, then I can set it up so that it looks like daylight. So, okay? Take care. Until next time. Bye-bye. You know I love you. <laughs> Bet you didn't think I was going to say it. <laughs>